Yo, what is going on, everybody? It's Epic here. In today's video, we're going over the Soul Render melee weapon. I'm going to show you guys all the camos on it. So here is gold, forged, platinum, and then interstellar, as well as the zombies camos. I do got to say, this melee weapon is pretty good. I'm going to bring it into the firing range real quick. Now, if you guys hold the trigger, it will pull out this animation and you'll be able to finish people in front of like any direction in front behind the side you'll be able to finish them but if you guys want to piss people off i definitely recommend that but i'd rather just stick to the meleeing i feel like you can get a lot more kills with that i'm going to show you guys all my perks now make sure you guys pause the video if you guys need to but hope you guys enjoy it and i'll see you guys next video peace All right, today we're using the sword render sword. Now you guys can see I already do have it in interstellar. Now there is a little trick with this thing rather than using like if you're playing stick and move like me and you knife with X, use the trigger and then you, if you hold it down, you do a finishing move that is, you literally cannot escape it. It's probably the stupidest and most broken thing in this game. For a melee weapon, obviously. Look at that. Nope. No no escaping that right there. Oh. Got you. What are you doing, brother? Oh, yeah, the sword is 13 feet, but couldn't hit him somehow. All right, spawn me in there, spawn somehow. See, and, and that little finisher thing is probably better than the normal fit. What? The normal finisher that you would do behind someone see i mean this is a missed opportunity right here you could imagine if you could throw the sword i'm not gonna lie that thing that would be amazing if you could do that just slopping people's heads off or slicing people's heads off. i don't know i said slopping what? I think I tried to say slicing and stabbing people at the same time. But I do gotta say, this is really nice and interstellar. I was thinking about getting it in Borealis, but I was like, eh. Takes a little bit more time getting that done. Just because you have to do like multiple games, you can't just do it all in one game. Because you do have to exfil. What are we doing here, brother? Are you gonna hop on the hill? Like they're not hopping on the hill at all. Oh my goodness. Alright, the sword is just doing 360s. Oh my god. I had no clue where that dude's that threw the syntax at me was. I thought Nikki on my team was an enemy. <coughs> you messed up there.
Oh my god, my game is so broken. He changed skins. Not really gonna go for a kill count here, just more like a gameplay. I know I'm making them a bit angry. Oh my god! You just got freaking sliced! And the bouncing betty got me. But I do have EOD, which makes no sense. <laughs> I'm making it mad. Yes, we are. So all you gotta do is run around a knife. Didn't even know he was in there. There we go. Easy kill right there. My that sword's like 10 inches long. How in the world did that not hit him? Went for the wrong person. So my sword doesn't hit him that time. BS. It might be better just to punch them, like, with whatever your melee weapon is, rather than the trigger. Just for the fact that if you want to piss people off, you can use the animation by holding down the trigger but if you actually want to like slice and dice click square or click x or whatever it is for xbox a I have so many kills. Now this is how you piss people off with a melee weapon. Shouldn't have pushed in there at low health. But there we go. 70 kills. Hope you guys enjoy it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.